Hi guys, Yuri here again. Welcome to YB Plays Music. So last week we started off with the first sharp version of a chord, which was the A sharp chord. Now today we are going to do the C sharp chord. Similarly to last week, we are going to start off by looking at the C chord. But if we start off just by the most common way to play the C chord, it's pretty hard to just move one fret up and then play it as that. It's possible, but it's not really a common way to play the C sharp chord. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start off with the second way to play the C chord, which was right here with my index finger on the third fret and the three other fingers here underneath each other on the fifth fret on the second, third and fourth string. And then we get the C chord. Yeah, and play the five lower strings. Now, very simple, like last week with the A sharp chord, to get the C sharp chord, we just move one fret up the arm, and then we get the C sharp chord. All right, so basically, like I said, if you have learned to play all the versions that I gave you in the first couple of videos, then this should be a piece of cake, because you're already used to these positions. All right, so this is the first way to play the C sharp chord. And then we have another way, and that's like the second way to play the C chord, but one fret up the arm. And the second way to play the C chord was right here, with my index finger over all the strings on the eighth fret. And then we just move one fret up the arm, and we get the C sharp chord again, like here. Sounds a little bit higher, but it's the same chord, all right? So that's basically it already for today. So I hope you learned something again, guys. Next week, we are going to do the D sharp chord. I hope you stay tuned for that one. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video. Also, don't forget, I have reaction videos and music videos for you guys to check out. So thank you very much, and see you guys next time. Bye.